with Chief Meteorologist Nick Jansen. Hey, good evening, Chief Meteorologist Nick Jansen here live at the final Thursdays downtown here in Rochester. It's kind of sad that it's a final Thursday, but come on down. It's going on until 830 here tonight, and we have some dry conditions. So good news there. Temperature is pretty comfortable here in Rochester right now. As we take a look at our current temperature in Rochester, we're at 77, still registering some sunshine at RST, but if we look up at the skies, we do have some cloud cover here at downtown uh, at Thursday's downtown dew points are currently in the mid 60s winds at about five miles per hour. Temperatures locally still some upper 70s and some lower 80s. We had high temperatures today in the low 80s for most of us. Some of us though in northern Iowa reaching close to around 84, 85 degrees for high temperatures earlier on this afternoon. Current satellite and radar, we have picked up some cloud cover. It kind of felt a sprinkle down here at Thursday's downtown, but we're not looking at any type of rain that would impact Thursday's here tonight or really anything through the rest of the evening. That'll change late on tonight, extending into early Friday morning. We'll take a look at your weather headlines here. Some storms late after midnight here tonight. We're kind of looking at about 1 until 6 a.m. coming up for that. It's a chance for some showers and thunderstorms. Friday morning and then Friday afternoon. We'll talk about Friday afternoon here in a second. And then we're looking at this weekend, some sunshine on Saturday, and then another chance of some showers and thunderstorms coming up on Sunday. We'll take a look at your severe storm outlook for Friday here. Uh, we do see the potential for some strong to severe thunderstorms after about 6 p.m. coming up on Friday. I think they're isolated through most of the afternoon and evening coming up tomorrow, but again, could be on the strong side of things. We'll track out that chance for those showers and thunderstorms here. Like I said, our first round overnight tonight, notice by about 2 o'clock starting to make the I-35 corridor. I do think they'll weaken as they move into about the Highway 52 to Mississippi River Valley corridor. Those showers move through quickly, so not expecting a lot of rain overnight, but we could have a quick downpour in some areas here before about sunrise on Friday. High temperatures warm nicely through the afternoon on Friday. We're back to the mid 80s. Now watch the atmosphere. We'll be energized with temperatures warming into the mid 80s, and this is why we have that level two out of five for severe weather for tomorrow, because notice the thunderstorms, they pop quick and then move out of the region quickly. So we're again about six to close to eight to nine o'clock. We'll see the threat for showers and thunderstorms, dry conditions then settle in through the overnight hours into Saturday morning. That weather timeline here, so again, chances for showers and thunderstorms isolated from about 1 until 6 a.m. Friday, and then again after 6 p.m. on Friday evening. That second round, we could have some stronger storms possible across the region. Forecast here tonight, we'll just have some overcast skies until after midnight. Showers and thunderstorms likely from about 1 until 6 a.m. As we look towards tomorrow, we should be dry through most of the daytime hours. We'll re-energize that atmosphere through the afternoon and evening. Another round of showers and thunderstorms will be possible. Seven day forecast, 81 for the high Saturday, 76 on Sunday. Another rain chance to wrap up the weekend on Sunday. And then high temperatures on Monday, just in the lower 70s. And then we're back to the uh, lower 80s by Wednesday. Hey, again, come on down. Enjoy the final Thursdays downtown here of the season. Beautiful night here in downtown Rochester. That'll do it for your first alert forecast. We'll send it back to you.